Hi, I'm Teacher Im and I prepare videos to help my students score better in their STPM Maths T paper and I hope my videos can be helpful for you too. Well, today we are going to learn how to use long division before integrating rational functions. Now, Basically, we are going to do our long division first before we solve questions like this, where the numerator has higher degree than the denominator, or for this case, the numerator has the same degree with the denominator. For this question, I'm going to apply the long division. If you have not seen my long division um, video, I suggest you do so because in that video, I taught you step by step how to use long division to break a rational function into the correct uh, format so that we can use it to solve our question. Okay, now for this long division, you can check it out in the video over to the, at the top there. And I'm going to continue with this question. Actually, in this question, other than long division, we can also apply it this way, where we arrange our equation because it has the same denominator, uh, at the same degree, I mean. It has the same degree, the numerator and the denominator. So we can actually arrange it in the format that we can change it into a format that we want in our integration. So we uh, just arrange it and uh, bring the uh, element, uh, whichever element that we need to adjust to the side and we can break this equation into the format that we want. But of course, for this video, I'm going to concentrate on long division. Okay, after having uh, doing that long division, we are going to put it into this position. It's the same actually if you use uh, the long division format or the arrangement format. Then we're going to write the quotient, okay, and then the remainder that's the x over there and the divisor. This one we learned in our SEM one, so no problem about that. Okay, once we got this, we can actually integrate this equation easily. So what is going to happen is we are going to check the differentiation of the denominator and we notice it is actually 2x, which means it is something that we can adjust in, uh, in the question. Like what I told you in my previous live uh, class, we can actually arrange uh, an equation into the format of f prime x fx to create this uh, answer in the form of ln. Okay, if you have not seen it, please check out the video uh, on my live show. All right, what we have here, okay, what we have here is I already broke this uh, equation into two parts. So that is the integrating of one, which is a very simple integration. And the second part I already adjust following what I have in the differentiation. So I adjusted the 2x to the top means I have f prime x on top and fx at the bottom. So what I actually can use now is this formula f prime x over fx is equivalent to ln fx. All right, so I'm going to change it over here with the formula. So this side, my integration of one, I get x, that is super, super easy. So the other one is a, this one over here. I change it with the formula of ln fx. So the fx is x squared plus one. So that answer will be ln x squared plus one plus c because this is an indefinite uh, integration so you must have your plus c and unknown over there right so that's the end of the question okay in my next question unfortunately in this question adjustment was kind of impossible here so long division is preferable okay so you will need your long division over here 
So that's the long division. So in this long division, which I already taught in the video of long division, so I'm not going to repeat of what I have here. So once I have that, like usual, I'm going to copy the quotient and that's it the quotient over there and then here is the remainder the nine i'm going to copy on top here divide by the remainder so the re, uh sorry the divisor 5x plus 7. so i copy it properly and then i notice this question has a few parts so i have i can integrate the x squared the x the value of negative 9 and over this part over here so this is uh, a fraction so i'm going to break check out this differentiation so i have 5x plus 7 okay i'm going to differentiate 5x plus 7 and i notice i have 5 but over here i have 9 so i'm going to bring the 9 out and change that position with 5 so i'm going to break this uh, equation to a few parts over here so i have x squared plus x plus uh, minus 9 so I, that that one I will integrate later uh, separately but what I'm going to concentrate here is the 5 over here that's the f prime x basically so when I differentiate this I get 5 so I adjust the 5 but like what I taught you in the uh, free class the online class live show previously you cannot change an equation you can only adjust it so i cannot have i don't have a 5 inside my main equation so i need to divide the 5 away okay so i have the 9 which already brought outside of my integration so now i can use the formula f prime x divided by fx so i can easily change this part here to my lawn so over this side, I just integrate like normal integration, integrate index plus 1, divide by index plus 1. So I will do the same for this one. And integration, integrating a number, I actually have minus 9x. Okay, if any of you need me to show you how to do basic integration, okay, you can leave a comment in the chat box or PM me in the telegram all right so these are basic integration which is uh things that you learn in your form five and that's the answer okay so that's all from this video and i hope to see you in my next video all right see you again bye